On Find Platform, let's go to the Products section. We will scroll down a bit. As you can see, there are three products. For this one, images have not been added. Similarly, images are missing in this product too. The third product indeed has an image. But, it is only one image. Now, let's see the process of adding images to all these products. For this, you need to know the seller identifier that you've given to the product. In this product, there's only one identifier, and hence it is obviously the primary identifier. Moreover, you can click here to verify if the identifier is primary. On your PC, go to the folder which contains the images of this product. Here we have created individual folders for each product. Each folder will contain only the images of that particular product. If you haven't created separate folders, we insist you to create them. Since we have kept the images of our first product in this folder, let's rename the folder with the seller identifier. Paste the identifier you copied earlier. Once you have renamed the folder, go back to the products page. Now, we will check the seller identifier of our second imageless product. Scroll down a bit. Copy the identifier. Go to your PC. This is where we have the images of the second product. Let's rename it with the seller identifier we copied earlier. Once you have renamed the folder, go back to the products page. Now, we will go to the third product for which more images have to be added. Scroll down a bit. Since this product has multiple sizes, you can copy any one of the seller identifiers. It's completely up to you. Go to your PC and rename the respective folder with the identifier. Now, since we are adding images to all three products, let's select all the folders. Right-click and let's create one zip file out of it. Give an appropriate name to the zip file. Go to Find Platform, and click on Import. Select the Import Assets option. Click here to upload. Select the zip file from your PC. You can also check the total number of media that is ready for upload. Click the Upload button. Refresh to check the status. As you can see, media upload is pending. Let's refresh once again. The media files have been uploaded successfully for all three products. Now, we will go back and check the products. The images are now present for the product. Let's click this. As you can see, this product's images are now available. Similarly, you can check other products. For this product which already had one image, now more images have been added. And finally, for this product as well, you will see all its images that were uploaded. That's how you can add multiple images to one or more products using a zip file.